Hi guys, this is App Unwrapper. I'm back with my walkthrough for Rusty Lake Roots, and this video will take you through the chapters of The War Hero, The Trenches, and Communication. So first, The War Hero. And for this, look down here, ignore the bike for now. You can see here, tells you that Samuel and I are dead. We know that already. We just kill, helped kill them. All right, so this map here tells you that uh, you need three pigeons to go to A to get that piece, that bike part, two pigeons to go to B to get this piece, one to C, and four to D. So we're going to focus on B and C first, since they can be done together. So go over the pigeons, and they each have an angle. Each of these uh, little holes have an angle uh, and that's the starting point for the pigeon so if you set it up like this oops set it up like this and you look at the map now you have two pigeons that are headed towards B and one towards C the D is not going to bring anything back but the other the others will so ring the bell and now Go back, ring it again. That's my cat crying, sorry. Okay, so now there's two parts. Pick them up. And let's go back. So now we need three to A. Let's work on A. So for A, you need... Like to go like this. So if you look at the map now, so you actually, so blue is the only one not going to A right now. Ring the bell. Ring it again. And there's the part. Pick it up. And now, so last one, we need 4 to D. So to do that, So take a look at it. All four are now going to D. Ring the bell. And if you need help, if you couldn't see the, the maps in time or the birds in time, uh, just go to my website. I have screenshots of all of them. So now you have all the parts. I also have a picture of the bike. So you can look at it while working. And it goes like this. I'll put all the pieces down first. And last one. And now he'll head off and see the chapter. Okay, next, the trenches. So this is a very weird one. Uh, come over here, take the wooden cup and the wooden leg from the table. Also, go through Leonard's pocket and find this key. And use the key to get the pincers <coughs> and the scissors you're going to get from the other drawer. Okay. Now the weird stuff. So, first cut off his bandages. Cut open these bandages. You're gonna move the band aids to cover the blood. Okay. 
next add the cup and leg so he's a wooden leg and last <clears throat> cut open his shirt and pull out the bullet and now his eyes are open but they're white you want to go in and you're gonna he wants to go home so you're gonna pull the ring on the grenade and now in a war zone so what you need to do is drag the up top half of the silhouette to its bottom half and tap it so he wakes up screaming and you're gonna go back in you're just gonna keep torturing the poor guy okay now we have a couple So do the same thing, don't forget their pieces over here. Okay, tap it, wakes up screaming, I'm gonna keep bothering him. Okay, this time it's Leonard, not Leonard, this time it's Albert. in his scary mask. And again. Alright, Mr. Crow. Okay, grab the key. Now we're gonna go in one last one. Well, I don't know if this is probably the last time, but um, before we go, use the key, get the gas mask. All right, this time, whoops, before we go, put the gas mask on Leonard and now pull it. Okay, so now he's actually standing. So we have these symbols, and you need to move them around the same way as the other. Okay. One more piece missing. Where is it? Right here. Okay. So now there's these three symbols. <clears throat> Memorize them, or if you need more help, you can look at my website. You could always look at the come back, but it's easier to just remember them. So the triangle, circle, and then that weird thing. Okay. Come over here and remember those shapes. Went like this. This and this. open it up, take his foot. Yes, he kept his foot in the lock box. And put the foot in the jar, and it's another sacrifice. And complete the chapter. So now we have another. We already have seven. All right, communication. Come over here. We're gonna meet uh, Rose. So tap on Rose. She says, "Can you hear me?" So you're gonna answer with the Ouija board, "Yes." Tap on her again. She says, "What is your first name?" So if you come over here, you are William Vanderbilt. So, I'll do is the, his brother. You're William. So come over here. Okay. 
right now. What is your, what is your last name? name? So spell out Vanderbilt. Okay. Now, do you want my key? And obviously you do. So now she'll give you the key. Okay, come over here. Use the key to unlock this drawer and the silhouette's in there. Take the key and it says live. So go back over here. Open this with the key, and here it says timepieces, and the other one says sacrifices bring rebirth. So, I'm just going to ask you another question, what do you want? So the answer is live. What do you, what do you need to live again? The answer is sacrifices, we just saw it on there. That leads to rebirth. Okay. What do you need? To what do you need to open the gate? What so the answer was timepieces. She says she will help you. And that's the end of that chapter. So I'll be back with the next chapter called The Well Part 1 in my next video. And if you enjoyed this, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks. Bye-bye.